A tough morning for U.S. soccer fans everywhere. The U.S. getting shut out by Costa Rica in the qualifier 4 to nothing. Marcus, what happened? Well, morning is the right word. Uh, <laughs> morning with a U. Uh, U.S. soccer hit rock bottom last night against Costa Rica. Uh, one of our colleagues earlier told me that it's probably the low point in the last 15 years plus, actually since the 1998 World Cup when they went home uh, three and out. Um, they played terribly. Uh, they lost against Mexico on Friday, and it just got worse and worse as the uh, game against Costa Rica went on. And Jurgen Klinsmann, the head coach, he's in the hot seat this morning. You think maybe he should, you know, get the boot, get fired? Well, I actually said it after uh, U.S. lost in the CONCACAF Cup to Mexico. Um, one thing about soccer is that if you're not moving forward, you're staying in place and everybody else is passing you by. Um, I think this U.S. team peaked probably at the 2014 World Cup and they've been experimenting and trying new things, different things, but I think overall they've been stagnant since then. So I think Klinsman's position is probably untenable at this point. Well, Marcus, you mentioned that they did fall to Mexico on Friday, so they dropped the first two of the Hex. Any chance that they make it to the World Cup? Well, yeah, there's still a chance. Uh, there's still eight more games in the hex hexagonal round. Uh, they're going to play them all in 2017. Uh, if Usually it takes around 15 to 17 points to assure qualification from, for the uh, World Cup. They have zero now, but through those eight games, there's still 24 points left on the table. Um, I think they'll make it, but it'll be by the skin of their teeth, kind of like Mexico in uh, the 2014 World Cup. All right, well, there you have it. He's an expert, so if you want to follow along as this season progresses, follow Marcus at MK Omar or me at Cox Courtney, but make sure to keep it locked in for all your soccer news right here on Nesson.com.